Ladies and gentlemen, skittish bags, welcome. Joey Moss, Bad Boy Game. We've got Pandemonium Constructed. Just want to take a moment before I go over the deck, uh, what Pandemonium Constructed is. Whenever a creature you control enters the battlefield, this emblem deals damage equal to its power to target creature and opponent controls. If you like a world where creatures keep damaging each other, bring your deck because this event is for you. Shaper Sanctuary, Thorn Lieutenant, Polyraptor, and Honor Guard are banned in this format. Makes a lot of sense. Uh, except for the Thorn Lieutenant, I'm not really sure I get that. But anyway, we're going to enter the event. Let's go over the deck. Undefeated 20 and 0 is what we're using. Four Colossal Majesties, four Rangers, four Steel Leaf Champions, four the Sword Twos, place at a Ferox, place at a Raptor, or not three, I'm sorry, three Raptor, three Vinemare, two Vivian Reed, three Carnage Tyrant, three Galta. Uh, four Galta total. 25 Forest. That is the entirety of the deck. Very uh, simple, very to the point. Big creatures that deal damage. Let's go. Last time I played with this deck in this event, we went 20 and 0. I think things are going to be different this time. Hey, Joe Black. Welcome, Joe Black. I think things will be a little different this time around. Um, as uh, I did not upgrade the deck with anything new. Except I did make one change, and that was adding an additional Galta to the build. So we have a playset now of Galta in the deck. Just because when he hits, it is almost impossible to take that sucker out. Joe Black 182. He's a, he, his name's Joe. He likes his coffee black, and he's a fan of Blink 182. Profiling. That's right. Watch out, guys. Mono Green versus Mono Green. Alright, he gets a little jump on us by having Lana Wars out, and we have no answer for him, but we do have Jade Light to answer one of them. Five, five mana. Goes Wilderness Reclamation. That is weird. In a mono green build, you go, Will, what is your, what is your, what is your plan there, Joe? Joe Dirt? What is your plan there, Joey? Tell me a plan, Joey. I'm talking to myself now. We're gonna knock out Lonnie. We'll see ya. Nice. Oh, I don't want to discard that. I did. I didn't want to discard my force, but we did. Maybe that probably wasn't a good bet. We did draw two of them. We don't need two right now. The old discovery path, eh? Alright. I think I see what he's doing here. I think I think I do. Um, we will go Vine Mare, because it has Hexproof. Dropping the Hexproof creatures first is pretty powerful. Alright, got that in. I'm really curious what he's doing here with Wilderness Reclamation and Path of Discovery. This will be interesting, Mr. Black. Alright, he plays nothing. That's cool for us. Um, we will drop Vivian in that situation. We're plus one. How this the wilds are my yep. shield. Well, to be protective, we could go null hide. We could go null hide to be more protective here. I do like that, and then we can just get our emblem out. Let's do that. Just for fun. This is this turned into a meme deck. I'm sorry guys. This just turned into a meme build. We're gonna try to get our emblem. We'll see what happens. Yeah, I'm not sure what he's doing here. I mean, I guess this is game. No one knows the wilds like so I. No hide. All I want is my ammo. Um, if he has no creature next turn, uh, that's game. I mean, the hexproof dudes are are really rooting for us here. They're the hexproof gods. I've come to shine. What is this? Okay. We were a turn away from getting our emblem. He can take out Ranger. So baller on a budget. I get it. Baller on a budget build. Baller on a budget. No problem, Bob. No no prop, Bob. That's cool he has the explore ability though. Smacks that down. He null hides. Whoa. I see, I see. Let's plus that up. Yeah, wilderness is cool. It pays for the null hide, I guess. You can't stop nature. Another uh 
Another one of these guys, huh? <laughs> yeah, that concludes that broadcast. Gleek. Moving forward. One win in the books. We got a reward. It is a dry green safe. Sweet sauce. Moving forward. Ooh, if you must know, I am feeling a little better, although I did have to cancel a dentist appointment today. Kind doctor. Quite the answer. Um, I did have to cancel my dental cancels. I did have to cancel my dentist appointment today. Reason being, I didn't want to make the entire office of ladies sick with the flu. Now you know. Um, it is on the last day. I think I'll be a hundred percent probably by Sunday. Today is Friday, but I think I should be hundred percent uh, by Sunday. So there you go. This looks okay. No hex proof though, which is really a key to winning with this build. Oh. I don't know, blue. What are you doing with that blue over there, boy? What are you doing? You, what are you doing with that white over here, there, boy? What are you got going? What are you doing with these flying creatures over here? What is going on? I'm gonna drop this for us here. Let's see what you got. Favorable wins. I'm gonna show you something favorable, Doctor. Something you gonna really like. The old pound pound. Supreme from Joe and Moss. From me to you, player, player. Ooh, that wouldn't be enough to damage him all the way. We gotta go steal Eve here. In the face. You take that damage now, that doctor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Name that, name that uh, movie. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Some, someone's gonna get it. They better be. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I make myself laugh, sorry. Sorry, it's what we do around here. I, I'm so tempted to drop Nalhide right now, but. Um, he's probably gonna have. He might have a sleeper. It looks like he's having some weird sleeper going on here. Uh, but. Oh well. Let's drop this. You couldn't counter it, I guess. It's a big card. I really would want counter. We're going to get five damage in regardless. Honestly, Jade Light Ranger in the early right there should have been the, the way to go. Oh, no. You think he heard us doing that reference? It was Sling Blade, by the way. I think he, I think he uh, finds that we're having too much fun here. The doctor. Oh, he steal away our steel leaf. So, you know, couldn't you just have, like, used a creature, like an angel or something in the deck? And just gone boom and smacked him in the face? I mean, he's clearly running angels. He has creature control with flying, get plus one, plus one. It's pretty beast mode right there. Does he have a planes? Come on, Doctor. I always wanted to beat a doctor's face. In. Yes, yes, yes. In the virtual world, children. Don't get crazy. Think of the baby. <coughs> Blade Instructor. 3-1 drops a sweet saucer. Blade Instructor hits the field. And then immediately leaves the field. Skadoosh. <laughs> Did that for uh, Landra. Um, yeah, we can keep him on. Keep him on board. Next turn we can cast him. If he get swept. Usually when they see a gall to hit the field, it's just concede mode. Concede mode. I haven't mentioned this yet. Uh, one of the decks that would be tough against this would be Gruel. I think Gruel would be ferocious. Gruel would be devastating. Gruel is would be a, a, a good a good bout. Pandemonium. It's enabled. Good boy. Alright, we didn't get Galta, but we can't cast him just yet. We're gonna go with Mr. Ripjaw over here, because he's fun. That'll be just enough to take out Arrow Sauce here. Aerosmith is now gone. Swinging for six. Ooh, down to eight. If he has no move here, that is game. 
And another one bites the dust. And another one falls, and another one falls, and another one bites the dust. Oh, yeah, yeah. Whoa, big play there. Still not letting us cast our Galta. Yeah, it's a ripoff. Sometimes Galta can be tough to get out, because we are running four. You could run three, one could say. I think in this situation, we're going to play our Ripjaw Raptor again. <laughs> and that's about it. You can counter. Oh, no counter. Swinging it with Null Hide Ferox. He might as well have paid the two and swung our Ferox back. All right. He needs, to answer, he needs an answer for both of these. A sweeper would do it. If he can just annihilate everything, that would be the answer. Do you have an answer, Billy? Doctor? Do you have an answer? Oh, that's an answer. Jeez, that was an answer. How many lands can we get? Is that a glitch? I think he just glitched. What happened? Did he glitch? Can I select all of them? I think the answer is none of them. I think the I think I think the answer is none of them. I think it was a glitch there. I'm not sure what happened. All right, we got two wins in the books. We're trying to dodge the mighty Gruel. Gruel would be our competition here. And if we see one of them troglites out in the middle of the forest, we're going to slap them with the base. Right in the brown eye. This looks mediocrely strong. We're going to keep it. This is really slow, though. If they have haste, we're in trouble. Good news is we went first. We can null hide, null hide into a Galta. That's kind of the goal here. Ooh, he's really going to play that on us. Gate deck. Can Gates win in this? I don't know. I mean, we're going to have a lot of big creatures. I just, I just don't know. And how are you going to gate a Galta? And then null hide. What are you going to do with the null hide, bro? Roll spiral, young man. All right. I think we shall go with null hide. So null hide and null hide in Galta. If we can get that far, that just changes. He was he was clicking away really quick until he saw null hide drop, and he's like, uh, "Change of plan." All right, this might not work as I thought. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I may have to. I'm going to have to mix things up just a bit here, Mr. Moss. Why are you growing that girl too, Mr. Moss? Drops a guild summons. That's good. We'll get him some damage. He is tapped out. Plays his guild gate. We go with another null hide. So next turn we can do a lot of Down to 14. One, two, three, four, five. He does have all the gates he would need out. If he does sweep, that would be six. It's blaze. Oh, just shy of what we were hoping for. All right, we can play this. And then we go with Vivian. Looks like we're in, we're in for a long haul here. Would you like come to me? Ooh, Vivian. Hallelujah. Do we want to go to right now? Not yet. I'll take Jade Light. So we can Jade Light, Wayward. This should be an interesting pouch. That big old 8-8. Eight, eight. I never thought about facing off with gates. But we can make everything like indestructible. If he gives us too much time here. If he doesn't have an answer for Vivian Reed, man, that thing's gonna get out of control quick. Three turns. But there's a lot of gate deck can do in three turns. This is going to be our biggest challenge yet. Can you deal with that? Mm. Another spiral of the growth. Gee, why don't you throw reclamation uh, up in there while you're at it, there, boss? 
Joda. Oh, he's got big stuff. Nice. Nice. He's got big stuff. Alright, we're gonna go with old Ripjaw here. Just to take out old Joda there. Almost oh, there. So he's gonna be dropping huge things. I've seen things that would break another forest. Like you. We'll take it. Drop another jade. Um, we can graveyard that though. Another landy, handy landy. Next time we got Galta. Remember, Vivian's one away. After this turn. After my next turn, it's one we can just get that emblem, and then everything is just 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 crazy sauce. Ooh, that's a big one. Ooh, that's a big one. Oh boy. Oh, I already killed that. Nice. Oh, I've never seen that art before. That's really cool. That was cool sauce. That really was cool sauce. So we can go wayward. We're gonna kill that. We're gonna go wayward, steel leaf, and then Galta. Sure, why not? Plus, I eat it. Balance. Um, I think Carnage is a little more appropriate here. Go Carnage. All right, so we go steel. Pink. Sword. Punk. Forest. Galta. And then next turn, Emblem on the Vivian. That was really cool. What are you gonna do when Hulkamania comes for you? How many how many gates is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He could he could use a gates of blaze and then drop a creature and take out hunger. But next turn, everything's indestructible, plus two's on it. So he needs something crazy. Like he's up against two two evils here. You got the emblem about to crack. This is a good matchup. Oh, I like the good matchups. I like the good matchups. Give me a good matchup. We found a good matchup. Come on, Sago. Oh. Oh. That can get out of control quick. But then so can this. Oh, we got the emblem. Nothing stands before nature. That's insanity. Oh my gosh. Boosh. All indestructible. Good game. Good game. That was fun. Gates. Gates. Oh, we'll see you, Gates. Gates is out to running. What do we get? Scrabbling claws. Three wins in the book. Can this deck still go undefeated is the question. In pandemonium. The 20 and 0 is back for more. I'm a maniac. Maniac, and that's for sure. And I'm running like I've never run before. I feel like I got cow. Cow nips right here, and I'm just pulling on them. Little tucker, calling a tuggy tuggy, tug of war with the nerve. What, what do you call those things? Can you milk a cat? No, I don't think so. All right, here we go. We will keep. This is looking kind of slow, though. Looking kind of slow. Doof wagon. Yeah. Stan Darsh. All right, we're back. We're back in it. Oh, yeah. Up against Gruul. Uh-oh, this is one of our um, less desirable matchups. Gruul is powerful. Yes, Gruul is. we go with Wayward first to get more lands out. There we go. <coughs> Excuse me. Maybe Ripjaw would have been a better answer there. This is one of our more challenging matchups, is Gruul. Doofwagon. Doofinit. Ooh, what's that? Ew. Hit us with some damage. 
All right, we're gonna smack the base. Bam! You put nice. Well, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. So we got one, two, three, four, eight. One turn away as we get another three drop from uh, getting Swordtooth to go off, but also we gotta keep both these alive. Swordtooth against Gruel early on is pretty sluggish. He doesn't do a whole lot. Okay. He's got the old shaman. Lotta galata. Well then, that's the ball game. So we're gonna play Steel Leaf, smack that. And Galta enters the battlefield. But oosh, I think we got it. I'll say hello. Demanding dragon solid. Demanding dragon solid. Takes that out. Um, we'll decline. We'll take five to the eye. We'll drop Ripjaw. Not enough to take him out, but close. And then we swing with everything. Man, that should be it. Even if he blocks Galta, it just rolls through with just Galta alone. Good game. Good game, friend. Good game, doof. Good game. <laughs> join me tomorrow. If you guys are still watching this, join me tomorrow. We're going to run... Maybe I'll do a different deck, um, but similar to this probably on Twitch tomorrow evening. And we're going to see how many wins we can get in a row with Pandemonium, or in the Pandemonium event. Mm. <coughs> Mulligan to the first time. I don't like this starting hand. This is kind of sketch. We have some. Ooh, what is he running? He's running stuff. Uh oh, we're up against stuff again, guys. Does anyone else switch around their cards on the bottom here? Uh, if you want to know about more about my Twitch, link in the description of every video. You can find it. There's also a lot of stuff. Like you can uh, follow me on Instagram. Uh, I post all kinds of wacky stuff, like uh, little little videos here and there. Fun stuff. Fun stuff. Two of these, baby. And the protector. But yeah, we have a lot of fun over there. Oh, Dawn of Nope. He drops the Dawn of Nope. Not a lot we can do here. Next turn, though, we can Vivian. Take out Dawn of Nope. Geth. Geth, I've played you before, Geth. You sound familiar. Looks like Geth got hurt on lands. I'll say hello to him. Hello. Yeah, it stinks. I hate when that happens. Poor Geth. Poor Geth. I think here we really want to apply pressure on Geth now. So we can drop our wayward. If that's not countered, I mean, we go right to Galta and we just basically end the game. There it is. Good game. All right, so there it is, guys. Bada bada bam bada bam bam bam. Pandemonium. Pandemonium. What do we get for that? Cool. Shaughnessy's legacy is our reward. No, it's not. Let's see what it really is. Ooh, 20 gems and Grim Captain's Call. Pretty sweet sauce. There you have it. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button. Share it with a friend if uh, it helps you win the event. You want big creatures. Uh, if you have hexproof creatures, you want hexproof creatures out. Just stuff along those lines. Anything with hexproof, throw it in your deck. It can't be targeted. It stays on the battlefield. If you can get a Vivian, you can get the emblem out. Have your hexproof. Just let them sit there. It's a great way to win the match. Um, you got to watch out for sweepers, and that's about it. Um, and watch out for them gruel decks. They can get you. Skidingle, skidingle, skadoodly doodly doosh.